Are you unsure which hitch is best for you? Whether it be the Rhinox Autolock Quick Hitch or the Hydraulic Quick Hitch. Keep watching this video as we run through what is the key savings for you, whether it be time, money, or the operational differences. Now for this video to really make sense to you, we need you to understand the key differences between the hydraulic coupler and the Autolock Quick Hitch. So we recommend that you watch the videos below before going further on this video. Done that? Excellent. Now let's go over these two hitches and find out what really works best for you, whether it be the hydraulic quick coupler, saving you time and money, or the standard manual Autolock coupler, which is perfect for every job that you have at hand. So let's get down to the operation which is quicker and easier to use. It really depends on what you define by being quick. If you're looking to literally just fit your quick hitch to the machine, the auto lock is the best option for you. There's no hydraulic operations or connections to connect up. You simply remove the pins like you would on your standard bucket and fit it to the dipper arm of your machine. You can then manually pick up your buckets from there. But with the hydraulic coupler, there's a little bit more that goes into the fitting process. But overall, it is much quicker to pick up and interchange your buckets and attachments with a hydraulic quick coupler. If you're not hydraulically minded and can't be bothered with the faff of sorting out your hydraulic quick coupler or going to your dealer to get it fitted and simply want the ease of being easily able to interchange your buckets and attachments, then I think the Autolock quick coupler is the one for you. However, the HQX quick coupler does have benefits over that of the Autolock. You can operate it from your cab. This means you don't need to get out, especially in those rainy, wet, cold days. Getting out of the cab isn't much fun, is it? So if you want the operation from the cab, simply use the hydraulic quick coupler. It's much easier to interchange your buckets and attachments from the simple click of a button. Crowd it in, open the hitch out, release your attachment, pick up your next bucket or attachment, crowd it in and lock it, and it's done. It really is as simple as that. It means that you can use the right tools from the right job. You haven't got the faff of getting in and out of the machine all the time. I think it's a win. There are also limited amounts of moving parts to go wrong on the hydraulic quick coupler. You haven't got the tendency to lose the bar, which releases it, on the Autolock quick coupler. You've also got the sliding rail on the hydraulic quick coupler, which means that if you've got a variety of different size widths of pickup on your buckets throughout your fleet, this isn't a problem. The travel means that it can pick up varied pickups of attachment and buckets and peckers all on one machine, all on one hitch. You may be wondering about the breakout force. What is the difference between the two? The truth is there isn't much between them. The size of your machine dictates the size of the coupler. The components on each are relatively the same in weight, except the hydraulic quick coupler is a cast frame and the auto lock is a welded frame. So there's really nothing to worry about in terms of efficiencies on your machine. You'll be able to get the maximum out of your machine and always maintain efficiency. And finally, comes down to price. This is usually a deciding factor for most. It really depends on how much you use your machine and what environments you're using your machine in. If you're looking for something that is efficient and also saves you time and money, you don't necessarily use the machine a lot, the Autolock quick coupler would be perfect for you. It comes in at around about 550 pounds, which means it's a perfect for that budget requirement. But if you're using your machine day in, day out, and you're interchanging and changing different tools and attachments all the time, then if you're looking at the whole picture in terms of the outlay of the cost and the time savings to you, then the HQX quick coupler is the best option for you. So the HQX quick coupler generally comes in, depending on the size of the machine, for a 1.5 tonne, let's say, around about 1,300 pounds, including the fitting kit. But the real deciding factor for you is how much it saves you in time and money on those long projects. So then what about replacement parts? Well, it's quite obvious to say that the Autolock quick coupler is more economical and therefore the replacement parts are very easy to come by and as a result, cost effective. But as a whole life cost, HQX, there's very little to go wrong with it. There's no gracing points. It's really just the piston and then general wear and tear, topped out by our two year warranty. And when it comes to selling your machine, it will increase the overall resale value of your machine as well. It really comes back to how much you use your machine and what you're gonna see out of it in terms of reward and return on investment. So if budget really isn't an issue to you, then the HQX will be the best option for you. It's easier and simpler and safer to use, less time out of the cab, 
maximum efficiency. But if budget is a concern and you don't use your machine a fat lot and you just want to do those jobs with crisp clean efficiency and the speed of interchanging efficiently, then Autolock Quick Itch is the one for you. If you want to know more about any of our products and services and check out our videos on YouTube, because there really is a lot now, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on a single upload. <laughs> Start again, guys. Machine day in, day out on a blessed fly. <laughs>